right, I'm going to the post office, have more orders. Loki's gonna come with me. <laughs> so, let's get the window rolled down for him. All right, he is super excited. I also got a seat cover. So I still have a bunch of stuff that needs to get donated, but I finally got a seat cover. I mean, look at this seat. Oh, it's slobber, I gotta clean this car. Okay, caught it fresh. Loki came in, ate his some of his food um, with his HelloFresh. He stopped, came into the office, shook his head, and look at the wall. Look at this wall. Look. From that one shake. Look at this. That's older, but all of this just happened. Like, that is just absolutely ter- dis like, it's disgusting. I was gonna say terrifying, but it is terrifying. Alright, I took a wet rag and wiped it. We'll see if that dries, but you can still see how bad the wall looks. Um, also, the house is kind of a wreck because I'm, you know, Christmas and yeah, it's a whole thing. That is Micah's empty box for her coffee table. You can see the instructions right there. So hopefully, in maybe like her next video, you guys will get to see what her bedroom looks like. I need to order another bottle. So right now my movie, or let me rephrase that. My what's on my TV routines. I do like to keep the TVs on. It just makes me feel good. And if I feel good, then I just feel like I have a really good positive day. And I always have like a routine for different seasons and different days and even different weather. So I'll show you guys what my current favorites are. But first I need to take my supplements. I feel like I'm trying to do so much at one time. I think it's because 
my, my mind jumbled up because the house is jumbled up. So it kind of like makes me, I don't even know. I'm telling you, things have impact, great and small. On this little TV, I wake up and most of the time, um, or at least for fall, it was I Love Lucy. Um, now, every morning, I put on Window Wonderland, which makes me sad for her and her family. But um, Window Wonderland is my movie of choice over here in my little coffee station. I'll also do Babes in Toyland and The Grinch, so I love those here. In the TV, the main TV, um, I've been doing Who's the Boss? So that's been fun. But then in my office, I put on YouTube. I'm in here the most. And so I like to put on, right now I have Rebecca Hoots. Um, but yeah, I like to just like put on and watch like all of my YouTubers. So I'm just doing, you know, let me, I don't have you guys in a tripod, so I'm just setting my phone down. I actually got a new phone case. This one, I think I've had it before actually, but it's so slippery. And the phone case that I currently have on is like pretty chunky and I've gotten used to it. Um, but it like sits up really nice and it's just easier for me to vlog with. Like this thing just like makes my phone fall everywhere. Eventually like I'll get to this um, when I stop vlogging off of my phone. But as you guys know, I bought this new camera or you might not know, but I bought this camera right here, the Sony and it's like ruined and dummy me. I didn't buy any of the warranty and um, it literally was probably broken when I received it and I actually really didn't like filming on it I thought that it had this like it's like it came with this filter on it that did like smooth out a lot but it just didn't look good it wasn't like a good finish at all I just scheduled donation pickup getting rid of things as I've just been like you know going through the house and decorating and I'm realizing okay I didn't decorate with this I didn't decorate with that those things gotta go um and yeah, I also want to make chili. I got all the stuff for chili. I just don't know if I have it in me to like physically do it. You guys know what I mean? When like you have to cook something, but you're just like, mm -hmm. yeah, that's how I feel.
body's gonna do its thing for six to eight hours. It just kind of depends on how I feel, honestly. And because I didn't make that much, I usually double the recipe. Um, I usually do two pounds of ground beef, but I'm doing one. So because of that, I'm just gonna do six hours. Um, but I'm making breakfast right now, I'm making my eggs sunny side up, some toast, my avocados. This is arugula, that's lemon juice. And then I'm gonna put my eggs on top of that. And then I'll probably sprinkle a little bit more lemon juice on the eggs. It's something new that I've liked doing. And yeah, so I'm gonna have some breakfast and then I'm probably going to um, film a video. It's been a few hours since my last little clip. I took my hair out of my braids. I don't even know if you guys saw that. I don't know what you saw because my brain is mush. I took off my vest that I was wearing earlier um, just because I started working around the house, getting things organized, done, just like all that stuff. And I put this on because it's like my little decorating thing that I love to wear every year. Sometimes I'll forget, but like I'm trying not to forget things. Um, this is from Dollar Tree, by the way, and I'm actually sitting here trying to plan Micah's birthday and Christmas. Like, I usually do this in August, you guys. <laughs> I am a five months ahead kind of gal, um, and I actually spend, like, a whole year thinking about an event, like, my brother's birthday or my sister-in-law's birthday, my niece and nephew, like, that kind of thing. Like, I just think about things in advance. Um, so the fact that I'm sitting here November 16th doing this when Micah's birthday is December 4th, but here it is. And I just got a notification from YouTube on my main channel. So not this channel, but Crafty Girl, the main one, that it is my channel's birthday. I knew I created my channel in November and I thought it was around like the 11th or the 12th. So, um, which... It probably is like I don't know it doesn't actually say it just says that it's my channel's birthday and it says it today but I could have like have said it yesterday too so I don't really know but they are correct it is definitely November I mean obviously YouTube would know <laughs> and get her to tell me what she wants um, so let me just start a list for her she did ask for a pair of shoes um, a pair of Asics which that's surprising. I feel like all of these like mom and dad brands are becoming very popular now. I did buy her wrapping paper off of Amazon. I wanted something um, really pretty that kind of like matches her room. Um, at first I was trying to go a little too mica literal, like her favorite colors, that kind of thing. Cause every year her wrapping paper is a big deal to me. Um, it's honestly more so for me than it is for anybody else, but like as for mom, I get, it gets to be for me, you know what I mean? So, um, especially since having her made my bladder lower and then it's not sitting in the right place. So now I have to pee every five times, every five minutes. So the wrapping paper gets to be about me and, um, I, it hit me. I was thinking about her sheets and her bed, which if you've like seen her vlogs, you've seen like her sheets, which are like a cute little floral pattern. And I was just like, you know what? She's going to be 22. I feel like, you know, she's really getting more into like the girlier things. And, um, cause Micah, Micah's style isn't like full on like girly, you know, there's like girly pink, chanel like little suits with a skirt you know you know that whole vibe not micah um she's more honestly i feel like micah would do really well living in france <laughs> i don't know why i think that but she just gives me french vibes and um so I was like, you know what, let me get our floral paper and I'll show you guys when it comes in. I'll show you her wrapping paper, but I do need to go to Hobby Lobby because I want to get like a velvet ribbon um, for wrapping our presents. And it's going to be very small. She really does not like a to-do. Um, I am going to go get her a nothing bunt cake. It's what I always get her. It's her favorite cake, um, red velvet. So I'm going to get her that. And then what did I write for her? 
I'm gonna get her like champagne. You know, she's 21, she's turning 22. So I'm gonna get her some champagne and I'll probably make her some like a birthday breakfast, maybe a really cute like breakfast charcuterie board kind of thing. Um, because that's about all she'll let me do. <laughs> so, um, I, I wrote balloons, but see, balloons are pushing it with her. But it, but she's 20, she's going to be 22, which in, in her era, in her like era of her people, whatever, this age, 22 is another big year, I guess, when it comes to social media birthdays because of Taylor Swift's song, 22. So I am kind of thinking about getting her the number two balloons, but she's never really liked it. But also my mind goes, but is it one of those things, you know, where deep down, like she does appreciate it? Do you know what I mean? Where you're kind of like, you look back and you're kind of like, you're happy that somebody did X, Y, Z for you, even though like you made a big, like, no, not me. You know, that kind of thing. So I don't want to not do something because sometimes, you know, she just has her own, like, thing that she does and doesn't like. But I don't know. I'm probably overthinking it too much. It's just freaking balloons. But if anyone has kids, you know what I'm talking about. Each one is unique and different. And Micah's just very low maintenance but she's also very like i'm low maintenance don't make me high maintenance <laughs> so but it's her birthday i want it to be high maintenance i have one kid you know so anyways that's those are my little internal struggles so the end of this vlog is probably just this little chat with me you saw me make the chili the chili is done by the way it's 4 48 now it was done an hour ago so it's still sitting on warm yeah all right so anyways that's my um little chatty how is it five o'clock in, in in dark and we only went back an hour you know what i mean like <gasps> look there's a fox Oh my gosh, it was just running across the, um, it was just running across the, the golf course and it came right, it probably ran through the neighbor's house and to the other side. I took Loki for a walk last night and, or not last night, a couple nights ago, it was pitch black and we were walking and I saw a pair of eyes and it was the little fox. It's probably the same one. And uh, and I turned Loki around the other way. This little fox just sat there. Sat there and watched us. He was up walking and then he just kind of like sat down like a dog and just chilled. I mean, I don't want to get near it and get rabies, but you know. All right. Anyways. Oh, I think I was trying to tell you guys that I just ordered something really cute on Etsy for Micah, like a little stocking stuffer. It's like a custom sticker. Again, like, I, I don't know. I like to do really cute things for the stocking. It's like my favorite part. And so I got a picture that is really cute that we got on vacation with Micah, Megan, and Holland. Um, and it's actually one of my favorite pictures. So I got this Etsy seller who does like kind of, she kind of transforms the sticker kind of into a cartoony version of it, but it also looks still real. It's like that in between. And um, I had her, I picked three. That way Micah can have one, she can give one to Megan and she can give one to Holland and they'll each have the same little sticker. Micah loves putting stickers on her um her laptop so i just thought it would be cute for her to have something of like her and her friends um so anyways i bought that so i'm just trying to figure out like really what i'm gonna do for her stocking this year uh, or more orders to do for 
Etsy, and that's all. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.